Hello internet, it is I, Malik Aaron Aaron, and welcome back to the channel, episode 241. Once again, news just pops up on a Friday when I really don't want it to, and it's really annoying me, because damn, I just want to make my prediction videos, and that's it. <laughs> Not deal with anything else, but... No, Disney just had to, you know, make this announcement, even like ahead of CinemaCon um, next week. They're like, no, we got some stuff to announce. We got some release date changes. Although some of these movies I already mentioned on the channel like several episodes ago, except now they have official release dates. Like I think I had released years, but some of these have dates now so that's what I'm going to be talking about mostly how the Mandalorian and Groku you know Baby Yoda that is officially going to be coming out May 22nd 2026 um it's the first Star Wars movie to be theatrical since Rise of Skywalker and the last Star Wars movie to come out in May was Solo, a Star Wars story. So, should probably hope that this movie will be better than both of those movies. <laughs> because, you know, Solo was a huge failure, if you didn't remember. That was a big nightmare. And then Rise of Skywalker, I don't even want to get started when it comes to that movie and its quality. But I don't know, Star Wars is, is in such a bad state that I feel like most people just don't care anymore. Like, instead of feeling like a big event, it's just going to be like, oh. When people are just going to, like, <laughs> it's a, a hard shoulder shrug at it. And, yeah, so it's hard for me to care <laughs> about it, but. For any Star Wars fan, all, all you fans that are still out there, I mean, you got something to look forward to, I guess. 2026. The Toy Story 5, that now has an official day too. June 19th, 2026. Sounds about right. Pixar movies, they love that mid-June release date. But with that, it's hard for me to care too. Like, it's just... It honestly shouldn't exist. Like, in a perfect world, we just have Toy Story 1, 2, and 3. Making Toy Story 4, you're already pushing it quite a bit. But to make a fifth, it's, it's just overkill. It just is. I think it's a huge mistake, <laughs> creatively. And I just don't see that demand being that great. Or Toy Story 5. But you know, Toy Story 4 made a billion, so maybe there is. Maybe Toy Story 5 can make that much? I doubt it. I really do. But for anyone interested, it's going to be coming out next. Well, not next year, two years from now. So there's that. Okay, so Moana, the live action version. It got delayed, although I, I expected it was going to get delayed. But I got delayed by a whole year. So instead of coming out next June, June 27th, it's coming out July 10th, 2026. Guess it because there'd be no possible way to, for it to get started, <laughs> you know, filming and everything. I don't even think it start. I don't think it has started filming. Because I know The Rock, like, he's busy, you know, this weekend. He's very busy with uh wrestlemania you know dealing with all that you know so it was a very busy man and trying to complete the live action one that is that wasn't gonna happen at least it wasn't gonna happen for 2025 but like Mandalorian, toy story who is asking for this who that's who the hell one a live action Moana, like all their live action movies of like live action remakes, 
Those are movies that are like several decades old. Moana's not even 10 years old. <laughs> like seriously, who, what, who is it for? <laughs> I don't... I don't know. <laughs> it's, it frustrates me to no end that it even exists. Because like you already have Moana 2, which was literally just like a Disney Plus show... That was, you know, re- that was that's being reworked into a movie. You already have that, so why have a live action version? Why, why bring why bring back Moana like full force in the in the twenty twenties? Like what? I don't. It it doesn't make sense. It really doesn't. But this is what Disney wants to do. So. Yeah. But that's not all, nope. Tron Aries, aka Tron 3, finally announced a date for next year. It is October 10th of next year. Um, I mean, that helps next October, because next October, that was supposed to be the Batman 2's month. Until it wasn't. <laughs> so that got pushed to 2026. It's not my help Tron Aries, but I don't know. A Tron 3, I'm not sure that's a good idea because, you know, Tron Legacy, when I came out in 2010, like Disney tried like hella hard to make that like a big event. And that movie only merely did okay financially. I don't think it did enough to like really justify a third movie but i've been hearing a tr- rumors of like a tron 3 for a while i remember rumors of it happening like a decade ago but apparently that version of the movie was scrapped because of a tomorrowland's failure if anyone even remembers that movie but now 10 years later about 10 years later we're finally going to get tron Three, I mean, it started filming, so I assumed it was going to get a release date eventually. But now it has one. So out of all these Disney movies, it's probably the one I'm interested in the most. But even then, I'm not, like, too excited about it. But yeah, for anyone interested, it's going to be coming out next October, so there's that. Then we got the Amateur... That got delayed. It's supposed to come out November 8th this year. It's coming out April 11th next year. I don't really care at all. I have no opinion on that. And apparently there's this movie called um, Night Bitch. Yes, that's the actual name of the movie. Um, That's going to be coming out this year. Limited release. I don't know... I'm I'm low key hoping that doesn't get a wide release because that means I have to have to make a prediction video for it and I feel like that video is gonna get age restricted with the title alone because <laughs> it's like just look at that thing <laughs> but yeah but uh, yeah that's basically all the important stuff that happened yesterday as I'm recording those. Uh, yeah, everything else is like small, really small scale stuff, nothing even remotely important, so it's no real point in discussing, discussing any of it, so now let's just, um, play that game, what will happen next, hmm, I mean, April, nothing should change, even though I feel like six movies should not be opening on a single weekend. And then you got May. May is looking aggressively whatever. (laughs) Same goes for June. Uh, Then you got July. Oh, that. Scarlett Johansson Chain Tatum movie finally has a title Fly Me to the Moon which which no yeah 
that's a movie. First of all, there was like this movie from like 2008, a really obscure movie. It was like one of those, like a 3D movie with like literal flies. And it was called Fly Me to the Moon. That's what I'm reminded of with this title. It's literally the same title. But yeah, so there's that, I guess. And then you got August. August is looking just whatever. September is looking, you know, the same. October. I know Joker 2 got a poster, not a trailer, but a poster. Or apparently some audio, too. Uh, We'll see how that movie... I imagine it'll have a trailer, like, probably this month. I would imagine. We'll see. And then you got next November. Not next November. This November. Amateur. That's gone. <laughs> um, that November is just getting more and more crippled by the day. <laughs> then you got December. Oh, Mufasa Lion King. The first image of that popped up and... The thing everyone was talking about is how Simba, his shoulder looked really I think it was Simba or Mythos. I mean, it's hard to tell with the lion because it's literally just a real, they're doing that stupid realist realism thing where it's just a normal ass lion. <laughs> and like it, his shoulder was really weird. Like, it looked off. It looked like it was in the wrong place. Kind of makes you think, is, like, AI made the movie? I wouldn't be shocked if, if we found out that AI, that Disney used AI to make the movie. I wouldn't be surprised at all. That'd be even more of a reason not to watch it. <laughs> but, yeah, there's December... And then all these movies that are like in the ether, that have been in the ether forever. And then you got next, you got 2025, you got January, February, March, uh, April, May, June, Moana, that's now in 2026, July, August. September, October, November, December. Uh, then you got 2026 here. A lot of untitled movies. There's Men and Lauren and Groku for May 22nd. Untitled Pixar film, that's Toy Story 5. And then July 10th, that's Moana live action. Oh, October the that's like Tron Aries. Uh, Avengers 5, because it's not called Kang Dynasty anymore. That's in May. Yeah, there's a lot of untitled movies. There's Batman 2. And... Well, Frozen 3 is still... Like 2026, but it never got an official date, so there's that. Um, but yeah, that's what things look like for the next few years. So uh, yeah, that's it. That's all. Make sure to subscribe, like this video, leave a comment, turn turn notifications, share the whole drill. You want to check out more videos like this? I got play uh, playlists on the homepage, all previous cancel episodes I've made on the channel. Um. All 241 episodes. If you want to watch any of them from beginning to now, I highly encourage you to do that, so go do it. There's also box office predictions, where I predict box office for movies. This weekend, like literally after I finish recording this, I'll be doing my prediction videos for the first Omen and Monkey Man. I'm going to do them sooner, but I was just too tired, and I lost track of time. So I'm going to do them now. You know, better late than never. <laughs> So stay tuned for those videos. But if you want to watch any of the past prediction videos I made on the channel, you want to watch any of the ones I've done this year, the past few years, you want to do that, go right ahead. 
There's also box office recaps where I go over the box office results for any particular month. Uh, March recap, that'll be next week. Probably like Wednesday. Yeah, yeah, Wednesday of next week. So stay tuned for that. But if you want to watch any of the past recap videos of me and the channel, you can go right ahead. And yeah, that's it. That's all. I am out. Goodbye.